Hi everyone, I'm Cristina Najera, your host. Welcome to Web3 TV. We are at the dinner VIP of Redacted and Hero. I'm here with Rahim. Welcome Rahim, thank you so much for being here. You are an advisor and an investor in Web3 and also my friend, so I'm very excited to have you. I would love to start asking you, how is your Web3 journey going? Oh, first and foremost, thank you for having me. Uh, it's super awesome to be here. Uh, my Web2 journey has been like very interesting because I got into it because of a friend of mine who was into the tech industry and he was like, you need to look into crypto, you need to look into these NFTs because I used to be an artist, a production uh, a designer, filmmaker, photographer. So yeah, that's how I kind of got into the space actually as an artist. Wow, so if you are an artist, you can also step in in this space. So how exciting. And what about your hero. Who do you consider your hero in Web3? Oh, this is an interesting question. I feel like lately I've been studying a lot of people who come from the traditional finance world a lot. I feel like a lot of the crypto world kind of revolves around how the basic economics of finances work anyways. So I feel like a couple of people that I look up to would be Zeneca, OSF and Mando, DC Investor. These would be like a couple of people I really look up to and be like, okay, how are they looking at the space? How are they thinking their investments? And yeah, those were, would be like some of my people. Wow, that's very important to be in a community in Web3. We mm. all know that. So how the community has helped you to be more exposed to this space, to be more eager to keep going in this journey? Because as we know, it's something that is not as stable as everybody mm. thinks. So what's the importance of community? So I think like in, a, in our industry, there's sometimes there's not really right or wrong way to go about things. It's very hard for you to predict what the right move is, what the right thing is. And I think one of the best ways to figure it out is to speak to other people in your industry. Understand where they are coming from, their thesis, their understanding. And I feel like when you're in a community setting, you get to hear everyone's opinion. Everyone has their opinion based on their past experiences, based on their financial uh, standings in life. And I think that kind of gives you a lot of perspective. And I think that's a great way to learn about an industry where a lot of times there's no like a career cut to move forward in some way. 100%, very good advice, thank you so much. And last question, how do you feel about the flight tomorrow? Oh, I'm super excited. I feel like, I feel like one of the things that's lacking in our industry is that we aren't able to grab the attention of the Web2 world. Um, and I was just like telling the team members, I feel like this is like a very Mr. Beast sort of a, like a campaign that you could see people outside our space be like, wait a second, why are all these people flying on a plane together? There's a Shark Tank thing happening on the fly. There's so many cool activations during that whole uh, period. I think that brings a lot of attention from the normie world to what we are building. And I think that's super fantastic. So I'm super stoked for everything uh, that Redacted team is doing. Sean, Kevin, everyone has been like super awesome in pulling this off, so I'm super excited. Wow, thank you so much, Rahim. Looking forward to see how is your journey in the flight. And you keep watching because we have more people that will come here and share their journey. Remember to share this with your friends and see you next time.